G63 check up this is wakey wakey let's see oh come on now yeah we know all right 175807 176 thousand kilometers 2017 boom looking good inside looking good inside doesn't look bad check up I don't need the game. Thank you very much. What do we have here? We have the racing uh, bonnet gastrat because this failed. 101 bonnet gastrat. Yay! Okay. You pull out on sparkler gentlemen. Looking good. Looking excellent. Sparkler can stay in place. It's supposed to have the new timing chain. Carefully, gently, don't fall anything inside. Yep, has a new timing chain. The oil dipstick has seen better days. We cool an expansion tank. Usually they're exploding. Yeah, you see that's burnt. You see the signs, right? Ah, okay, no pressure inside. How lovely. Coolant. Ah, it's okay. Okay. Yeah, now, yeah, it depends who you're asking. Somebody will tell you it's a water, somebody will tell you it's a coolant. Yeah, oh, all right. Ah, you top it up? Yeah. It was down. Yeah. Did you have? All right. You have to make also a leak test yeah. if you didn't have water inside. It has a little bit down there. You can see there. It's a good thing to make a leak test to see if it's leaking from anywhere. Okay. Let's. Close this. It has oil inside the engine. There is oil. Did you check anybody? They're securing. All right. Have a look on the engine oil with a racing dipstick. Clean it and serve it again inside. Build. The, ah, for the thermostat cap there, it's not leaking. Nice, surprising. The actuators for the solenoids looks clean. It's not leaking. Nice. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, it's here for what? For maintenance? Looks like. Yeah. Heater core back over there. Mercedes clamps. Being connected. What is oil? Yeah, it's okay. It's a cold one. When we're gonna warm up, it's gonna go a little bit more high. It's okay. It's okay. Well, we have seen worse than this. Here we have... Oh, shit. Here we have a leak. From where it comes this leak? Open the air box. And the insulation here that has for the sound. Okay, because I can see here an oil leak. It's supposed to be from the cover. Oh boy, how lovely. Let's continue since the guys are opening here. Let me continue with the tires and suspension. Shock absorber looks a little bit wet. Brake rotor has a minor leap here. Need to be measured. But still has more than 50% health. Who hit, who hit the spacer here? First week of 22, the rim looks okay. Tire looks okay. Fine. Let's move back. Rear one. Alright. It's missing one piece from here. 40 week of 19. Yeah. yeah has some cracks. Yeah, here in this country, you know, from the heat, the rear tires need to be replaced, I guess. All right, moving on. Are you sure about that? Up. Right. Okay. The, by the way, the brakes are new. The brake pads. Brake rotor has a minor lip. Same thing also from the other side. Where is the date? Oh boy. What in hell? They put it upside down or what? It's other way around. Or I'm blind. I might be blind. Alright, the thin 
strip it's inside on this tire. Well, we can raise it up, we can have a look on it. And on this one, the thin one, it's outside. So they put inside out from the, the rear right tire. <sighs> this is the outside, right? Since you can see the date, it's supposed to be the outside, or it has a rotation mark. Dang it, dang it. Oh, ah, outside. Here yeah, there is outside, clearly. And you can see the date. And like I said, the thin line, the groove on the thread, it's outside. On the other one, it's inside. So they misplaced the tire. Hey, let's see the front right. Yeah, you open it? Yeah. Nice. What is it? Ah, it's leaking from the breather here. All right, nice. Nice, that's an easy fix. These four bolts only. Yeah, you need the seal for the breather. Here, that's why it comes wet, you see? It starts from there, it's not from the cover. It's from the breather. Beautiful, nice, fast and easy. It's not even costing a labor or something. It's just only the seal and you're back in business. So, did I check the front right? I don't even remember. Brake pad same like the other one. Brake rotor, it's okay. 0521. Oh, come on now. I'll go my ground. Outside, yeah, there you go. Outside. This shock absorber. Ah, this is in better condition than the front left. The front left, it's leaking. All right, the skid plate down the cover. You remove it? Yeah. Ah, there was. All right, very good. Now, where, sir? Radiator. Yeah. Has a leak. Yeah. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, you're right. Classic. I have seen it before. It's not the first time. That's why I told you to make a leak test to see from where. Okay. Uh, lift it up, please, gentlemen. Raising up. Go, go, go. Now I'm watching the power steering pump. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like that the radio is leaking. You're gonna make a leak test to verify that. And it looks like that the rear tire, the rear right tire, they didn't place it properly. And need to change both of the rear tires. Okay, okay, all right, okay. Engine mounts, yeah, has a crack, classic. But like I'm saying, for G class, it's a solid rubber and has this stabilizer, the gas strut here, okay, for the sudden move. Has one here and has another one from this side. That's their front. That one I'm talking about. So again, if you're not jumping in the desert, eh, you should be fine. You should be fine. All right. Uh, wait. What I want to show you? I want to show you this. Omar, come here. Where are you? You see, the outside. It's supposed to be outside, not inside. All right. And the tires, they're not. They have some cracks, they have, ah, it's step also something here. Take a look. What's that? Don't take it out, we can start leaking. All right. Oh, this is Omar screaming. Yeah, has somewhere here and there. All right. Not bad. Since I'm back here, let's see. Let's start from back here, all right. Nice, clean, looking good, looking good. Looking nice, looking nice. Fine, you know. Transfer case, no leak. Transfer case mount here, it's okay. This one, it's okay, and that is okay. Yep, splendid. Transmission mount, I have to put my finger there. Where is it? No, it's okay. Transmission mount is fine. All right, doesn't move, no leak. Beautiful. Nice. It's not leaking. Amazing. Clean. 
clean. Can you please move the, the wheel left and right to see if it's playing from the bar here? You feel something? Yeah? Yeah. Move it again. No, what you feel, it's supposed to be from this one, from the gas strut here. Make it again, make it again, make it again to check the front one. It has a minor. Make it again. No, no. Wait, wait. Do it again. Again. Somebody was here. Somebody repaired the steering box. I see some light. Which one? Yeah, it's open. Which bolt is open? This one. So, uh, this one. Aha, uh -huh. uh, yeah. Definitely somebody was here before. Maybe they repaired the steering box. And they put the th three bolts only. The other one, yeah, it's okay. It's on. One, two, three. The fourth, no need. The fourth, no need to put it. How they did it? They disconnected only here. What in hell? This movement that you feel, it's from this one. Center one? Yeah, the center one, from this one. It has some space here, you know, if you disconnect this and you try again, you're not gonna hear, you're not gonna feel nothing. Well, I think, uh, I think we have one used one if you want to test it. I give you one, I think, a week ago, two weeks ago, in nylon, you remember? Yeah, you can put it just to see the, the, the tricky. All right, nice, clean. Only one shock absorber here, it's leaking. It's a little bit wet here at this point. Usually you're changing pairs, you're not changing only one. If you change the two shock absorber and this one, you're gonna see much more improvement on the steering, on how it's steering the car. All right. Remove the transmission sample. Uh, this, okay, you'll uh, take a sample from the transmission oil, get a sample from the transfer key oil, from yeah, an engine oil. Have, it's, uh, it has a bent, bent. So we need to change this one also, the oil pan. The oil pan, yeah, right, on the job card. Right on the job card, and good luck, because, you know, some people, you know what they're saying. Ah, oh, it's running like that for the last 10 years, <laughs> you know, <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. So I have stopped bothering with these things, you know what I mean? <laughs> There's no leak, and... It's a good thing, uh, we are riding for transmission oil, filter and seal for service, all right? But it can easily tell you that, you know what, it's a lifetime from the agency, we're not changing. I ride it, I ride also the oil pan that's been dent here, and, that's, uh, it's inside and... Under the oil, transfer this oil. Yep, I ride it, but we are suggesting that, and this, like always, it's optional, like any other thing. All right, you need to... To say something about this, you want me to? Did you make a health report? Yes, yeah, uh, So wh what do we have up to now? It looks like that the radiator is leaking. We have to make a leak test. The expansion tank, the cooling expansion tank. If you pressurize it, it might start leaking from everywhere, or it might crack because it's burnt. Sure. Shock absorber fluids. This mostly for service. Okay. And you have a health report? What do you have? Transmission one fault, engine one fault, parking system, it's for electrician, some for electrician, okay. Can you please change the page without showing the VIN to see the faults? Uh, there you go. <coughs> Just a second. The actuation of the valve of the oil pump in the combustion engine has an electrical fault or an open circuit. We are talking about classic, we are talking about this. This small cable over there, this is a plug. That one, this looks like it's being plugged in. So that means there is no connection from inside. This is when it goes, when it's on idle, it's opening the solenoid and does have full oil pressure. All right, it's changing the oil pump inside the housing of the oil pump. I have shown you this in the past. Parking system, communication with air, pyrotronic, warning element one has a malfunction, center left, front distance sensor fault. All right, 
some stored, 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 right brake lamp. So the coolant level has malfunction, the fluid level is too low. No, it doesn't have a malfunction, it's the coolant level is low. Yeah, the air quality sensor has malfunction, there's internal circuit fault. The air quality, if, I'm, if I remember correct on this one, it's supposed to be on the black air box, on the, yeah. where's their filter? Supposed to have one sensor, right? Uh, once again, all these sensors, electrical things, it's for the electrician. Okay? Communication with direct select. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Never mind, never mind about that. Did you check the battery? No. All right, let's put also the battery to see which model gear, if it's original or not. What? The driving seat front and back is not going. And uh, it's not moving uh, front and back. The electrician. And this one, the panel. Which panel? The door panel. Uh, the window. The panel always classic, bro. The broken one, what do change always? I make ignition on to check it. You check all the windows. You check the switch front. If it's from the switch or if it's from the... It's moving, but you can hear the inside of the stomach cable. And ah, you can see the shining case. This is what, transmission oil? Mm. Yeah, leave it, leave it to me. Oh boy. Yeah, don't be surprised, it might be the oil from the day number one that never never changed it. Can you please, ah, you already did it, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it makes weird sound, don't touch it. Need the mechanism inside. All right, uh, because I'm a little bit busy and I have to continue. Can I stop here the video? You yeah, want yeah. to check the battery? All right, like always, it's mostly for maintenance. The car here, radiator. Yeah, here in this country, it's hot country. Uh, just verify that it's leaking from here. All right, mm -hmm. Mohammed. Hey, mm -hmm. sir, come. Verify that it's leaking from here. Make a leak test. All right, to double check there. Make also a leak test from there. From the intercooler, we, you need also the seal for the breather here. It's leaking. All right. I'm gonna leave the phone to check it out again to write it down. Omar, he'll gonna check it. Mohammed here, he'll gonna check it again. To don't miss anything and to write it down. All right. Just the highlights through the video. Fine, Mr. Omar. Yes, bro. Let's go. Happy. Let's go. Thank you.